In the ethereal tapestry of television history, there exists a celestial gem that continues to beckon minds and hearts across generations. Close your eyes for a moment and let your thoughts drift back to that first encounter with the 1978 TV series, Battlestar Galactica. Remember the anticipation, the thrill of embarking on a journey through the vast expanse of space, a canvas adorned with stars and stories waiting to unfold. Whether you were perched on the edge of your seat or nestled in a comfy corner, the resonance of that initial connection remains. As the intro theme reverberated through the room, did your imagination take flight, soaring among the stars as the mighty Battlestar Galactica led the fleet against the relentless Cylons? Or perhaps it was the poignant exchanges between characters that etched themselves into your memory, the camaraderie, the tension, the unyielding determination in the face of adversity. Those moments became more than scenes on a screen. They became cherished fragments of a shared odyssey. And now, let's journey deeper into the cosmos of trivia and fascination. Nestled within the fabric of this iconic series lie hidden anecdotes and untold tales that paint a richer picture of its creation and impact. From the minds that birthed the concept to the unforeseen twists that shaped its trajectory, these random facts illuminate the constellation of ingenuity that brought Battlestar Galactica to life. So, as we embark on this exploration, let the light of memory guide us through the constellations of insight and revelation. Together, we'll uncover the threads that unite us across space and time. As fans old and new continue to find solace, excitement, and wonder in the galaxy-spanning narrative of Battlestar Galactica, ABC's 1978 TV series Battlestar Galactica, a space epic created by Glenna Larson, left an indelible mark on sci-fi television. Notably, its influence extended beyond its own universe. Props from the show found a second life in Buck Rogers in the 25th century, another brainchild of Larson's. The shared production lineage resulted in a resourceful recycling of sets and gadgets, bridging the gap between the two series and infusing a sense of continuity within the sci-fi genre. However, the story of Battlestar Galactica holds another intriguing twist. Premiering on September 17, 1978, the same year as the highly successful Mork and Mindy, the show initially captivated viewers with its space-faring drama. Yet, as the network sought to evolve the quirky comedy into a more serious narrative, its efforts led to an unexpected backfire. Mork and Mindy moved to Sunday nights to fill the void left by the departing series, saw a surprising decline in ratings instead of a boost. This turn of events prompted ABC to reconsider its earlier decision to cancel Battlestar Galactica, eventually leading to the creation of Galactica 1980. A deeper dive into the series reveals the imprint of Glenna Larson's Mormon faith. Nuanced references to Mormon practices and beliefs are subtly woven throughout the episodes. Elements like the Quorum of the Twelve, mirroring the Mormon governing body, and the term ceiling used for marriage, echo Larson's religious background. The exploration of moral lessons, intrinsic to each episode, further underscores the alignment between the show's themes and Mormon principles. In the annals of television history, Battlestar Galactica remains a singular entity, not only for its interstellar narratives, but also for its unexpected intersections with other series and its reflection of a creator's personal convictions. A legacy of this show continues to inspire sci-fi enthusiasts and cultural observers alike. Unveiling the intriguing legacy of the 1978 TV series Battlestar Galactica and the Pantheon of Science Fiction Television. The 1978 TV series Battlestar Galactica holds an esteemed position, captivating audiences with its futuristic narrative and captivating characters. Amid the captivating storylines and groundbreaking effects, a remarkable revelation remains largely concealed. The unconventional origin of Muffet II, the beloved Daggett drone. Conjured into existence by the masterful minds behind the show, Muffet 2 was no ordinary creation. Concealed within the endearing Daggett drone costume was an unexpected performer, a trained chimpanzee. Astoundingly, not one, but three of these intelligent creatures lent their talents to bring Muffet 2 to life throughout the series. The result was an endearing character that stole the hearts of viewers, solidifying its place in television history. The series also introduced the enigmatic Cylons, and at their helm stood the enigmatic Imperious leader. A term chosen deliberately, Imperious conveyed an air of arrogant dominance, setting it apart from the evocative Imperial, a term closely associated with another iconic space franchise. 
An unexpected twist of fate transpired when Patrick Mackney lent his distinctive voice to this Emperor of the Cylons. This choice of nomenclature suddenly felt serendipitous, as the Cylons' leader embodied an imperious demeanor that left an indelible mark on the series. However, one of the most compelling tales from behind the scenes involves the character Colonel Tig, portrayed by Terry Carter. Originally pegged for the role of Viper pilot Lieutenant Boomer, Carter's trajectory took an unforeseen turn due to a roller skating mishap. This twist of fate led him to embody Colonel Tick, a vital presence within the show's universe. More significantly, this decision shattered the cliches of the era, as the series showcased not one, but two prominent black characters, both holding pivotal roles. This strategic shift stood in stark contrast to its cinematic predecessor, Star Wars Episode IV A New Hope, which faced criticism for its predominantly Caucasian principal cast. As the annals of television history continue to evolve, Battlestar Galactica remains a steadfast testament to innovation and inclusivity. Behind the gleaming spacecraft and interstellar battles, the series concealed stories of chimpanzee actors, carefully chosen vocabulary, and the impact of unforeseen events on casting decisions. In its multifaceted tapestry, the show reveals not only the artistry of science fiction, but also the intricate threads that weave entertainment's broader narrative. Lawsuit over alleged Star Wars similarities dismissed for 1978 TV series Battlestar Galactica in a legal clash of the sci-fi titans. George Lucas and 20th Century Fox took aim at the producers of the 1978 TV series Battlestar Galactica, alleging uncanny resemblances to the iconic Star Wars, Episode IV A New Hope. While it's true that Galactica underwent modifications after its pilot to capitalize on the burgeoning Star Wars craze, employing the same special effects maestros and concept designer, the legal battle was ultimately shelved in 1980. The lawsuit, filed on claims of thematic and visual parallels, stirred the cosmos of science fiction aficionados. The series, helmed by Glenna Larson, did exhibit a certain kinship with Lucas Space Opera, as spacefaring humans waged war against robotic adversaries. Still, legal minds ruled in favor of Battlestar Galactica, emphasizing the distinction between inspiration and imitation. Although Galactica did ride the coattails of Star Wars, utilizing the same creative talents behind the scenes, the courts deemed the series sufficiently distinct to stand on its own cosmic merits. Larson's universe managed to carve its trajectory, intertwining mythology and human resilience in the face of existential threats. In retrospect, the lawsuit highlighted the broader trend of 1970s science fiction's surge in popularity, a time when cosmic narratives captivated audiences across screens both big and small. The legal wrangle inadvertently underscored the genre's societal resonance, mirrored by the Battlestar Galactica universe's tenacious fight for survival against the robotic Cylons. It's a testament to the enduring legacy of Battlestar Galactica that, despite the lawsuit's celestial clash, the show etched its mark on the tapestry of science fiction. While the lawsuit itself has become a footnote in the history of both franchises, the influence and creativity that stemmed from this period continue to inspire fans and creators alike. Battlestar Galactica 1978, a million-dollar space odyssey in the annals of television history. Few shows have left as indelible a mark as the 1978 series Battlestar Galactica. Created by Glenda Larson, the show catapulted viewers into a space-faring epic. But its origins, as Larson claimed, stretch back to the late 1960s. Originally conceived as Adam's Ark, the series proposed a gripping premise, human survivors voyaging through the cosmos in the aftermath of Earth's destruction, seeking a new haven among the stars. While the series garnered immense attention for its dazzling visual effects, it was a lesser-known fact that the production itself was a groundbreaking endeavor. Battlestar Galactica secured the title of being the first weekly TV series with a budget exceeding $1 million per episode. However, this opulent allocation came with its challenges. A substantial portion of the budget was devoured by the cutting-edge visual effects, leaving the production to resort to inventive cost-saving measures. Thus, viewers might have noticed the occasional repetition of effects footage throughout the series, a creative workaround to maximize resources. The show's youthful character, Boxy, remains a point of intrigue for aficionados. Curiously, Boxy's real name remained a mystery throughout the original series. It wasn't until the spin-off Galactica 1980 that his true identity was unveiled, 
Troy. Kent McCord, who was initially considered for the role of Apollo, portrayed Boxy in the sequel series, adding a layer of continuity to the Galactic saga. Gleda Larson had initially envisioned Battlestar Galactica as a series of made-for-television movies. However, ABC's swift acquisition of the concept prompted a transition into a weekly series format. This accelerated trajectory ultimately contributed to the financial intricacies faced by the show's production, leading to the innovative reuse of effects to stretch the budget. As we look back on the storied journey of Battlestar Galactica, it's clear that its impact on television and science fiction endures. From its cosmic odyssey to its budgetary challenges, the series encapsulated the spirit of innovation and imagination that defined an era. Even though Earth's survival wasn't at stake, the show's legacy continues to thrive, reminding us that the quest for a new home among the stars can be a journey worth remembering. As we bid adieu to the cosmos of Battlestar Galactica, the journey doesn't truly end, but continues within us. Just as the stars above remain distant yet bright, so too do the memories of this iconic 1978 TV series. Each episode, each character, each twist in the narrative forms a constellation in the sky of our minds, sparking thoughts that traverse time and space. Remember those evenings when you sat on the edge of your seat, your heart racing as the Cylons closed in. The show's ability to intertwine high-stakes drama with philosophical questions about humanity's nature resonates even now. The captivating blend of technological wonders and deep emotional turmoil open portals within us, inviting introspection and contemplation about our own existence. As you reflect upon the battles fought, the alliances formed, and the sacrifices made, consider how these echoes from the past shape your present. What lessons have you carried from the Galactica's Odyssey? How has it influenced your perspective on the struggles and triumphs of today? We welcome you to share your cherished memories, your lingering questions, and your profound insights. Let your voice join the cosmic chorus of fellow fans who have been touched by this timeless series. Your thoughts are the celestial debris that orbits the legacy of Battlestar Galactica, keeping its light alive for generations to come. Thank you for embarking on this cosmic journey with us. Your time and curiosity are valued beyond measure. Until our paths cross again in the starlit expanse of imagination, keep exploring, keep reflecting, and keep the flame of Battlestar Galactica burning bright within you.